Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to show you a lemming haul that I just recently did. Um, so I'm part of a Facebook page where the ladies from Makeup Alley Nail Board sell their polishes. So every once in a while there are people selling like amazing polish gems and you're just like, is this really happening right now? And so that happened to me a few weeks ago and I ended up picking up several polishes that were on a lemming list um, and I got them for very reasonable prices and so I just wanted to share them with you because I was very excited to get them. So first polish on the lemming list um, is Holographic Pearls by Revlon. So when this was all over the place for whatever reason I was like no you don't need that you have fairy dust, um, but they're not similar. This is way more dense, hollow than fairy dust. This can get pretty much opaque on its own. And then by the time like I realized that I felt like I wanted it, I couldn't find it anywhere. So there was another polish Revlon was putting in their displays close to where this had been and I thought it was the same polish and I went to the store and I'm like, oh, I better get it before they pull it from me. And I guess they had already pulled them from everywhere around here. So like I never got my hands on it. So the lady on Facebook selling had this and I was like, oh my gosh, now's my chance. I better get it. So I, I um, picked it up. And I'm going to show you these on a nail wheel um, just to show you guys. So let me put this on here. Um, so this is kind of similar to fairy dust. But like I say, it's much more dense. There's a lot more... Um, holographic particles or whatever you want to call it in this polish but um i've seen people wearing this on its own and i've seen people wearing this as a topper oh you guys look at that oh i think i'm gonna wear it on its own first to see that looks amazing very sparkly very hollow um, um so i also have mirror ball by orly but you can see they're like just different um I know that's crazy and that's probably because I'm a crazy polish person but this seems to have like more hollowness to it whereas this has hollow but not as much and then fairy dust is completely different because it's more like of a delicate hollow so uh, coming from a crazy nail polish person these are not the same this can also get opaque on its own and also be worn as a topper, but I've only worn this as um, on its own and it's three coats for the Orly to get opaque. So it'll probably be similar for this. Oh, you guys, look at that. How did I think I never needed this? Like, I don't even know. Sometimes I like wonder, am I crazy? Or like, do I just think things are gonna be around forever? And like, when I decide to come around and get it, it'll be there, I don't know. But anyway, I'm glad I have it now, so. Um, next polish, oh you guys, I was so excited to see this. So this is Warm and Fuzzy from OPI. I know there's tons of polishes out like this now and I don't care. I love the Muppets. And when the Muppet collection from OPI came out, it was like right before I got into polish. And so I never got any of the Muppets polishes. So I was so excited you guys to get this polish. Like you have no idea. My favorite Muppets movie is Muppets Take Manhattan and I love when Kermit and Miss Piggy get married and then they're like, I now pronounce you frog and pig. I just, oh, I love that movie. So when I saw this, you guys, like I had to have it and it seems perfect for fall. Like I say, I know tons of polishes like this have come out already and it was more unique back then, but like I don't care. It's more like sentimental, nostalgia, plus it's pretty um, and all that factors in. Oh, you guys, look at that. Oh my gosh. Totally amazing. So, oh, that just looks amazing. You guys have no idea how happy I am to have this in my collection. So excited. Then I got another one from the Muppets collection, and this is Excuse Moi from OPI. Oh, you guys, I love Miss Piggy. I think she's like so, so fun. Like a lot of people think she's like super bossy and super annoying, but to me, that's like, she's like original girl power. Like when you think back of like, you know, when we were younger, well, that was a long time ago, but like girl power wasn't a thing. And there was like a few people that like had the girl power and were like, you know, 
not afraid to speak their minds and like you know miss piggy to me was that she was like mm -mm -mm, kermit you need to quit oh my goodness you guys look at that oh i cannot wait to wear that polish and it's pink which i love and it's glitter which i also love and it's after miss piggy who i also love so super excited to have two polishes from the muppets collection then i have always wanted to try illa Masca polishes and i just never like got around to it they seemed like very out of reach to me or like too expensive and just hard to come by i guess and so i just never so i started painting first i'm sorry um so i've always wanted to try illa Masca polishes um and i just like i've never gotten around to it i think like in my mind they were a little bit out of reach they were a little expensive i didn't know where to get them from but i would see people posting swatches and be like oh my gosh that polish is amazing so she had some illa Mascas that she was selling that i loved when i saw swatch pictures of so i decided that i needed to get them and i got them for a very reasonable price so this first polish and it came in the boxes she sent them in boxes it's called speckle and um look at this so you guys know i was all about this um like speckled egg look in the polishes for spring i like was hunting them down so um so this so claire gray was doing like a um polish de stash and she swatched this on the polish de stash and she was de stashing it and i was like no claire and then i was like oh i want it but she doesn't ship to the u.s because i guess a lot of polishes get destroyed coming out of the uk so i was like okay and i was very sad because i was like oh my gosh i needed this so when i saw this on this d stash site or on this d stash sale i was like give me this freaking speckle like i need it i need this on my nails in the spring and i need this on my nails in the summer and oh you guys i'm in love it's like the cutest polish look at that adorable so i'm so happy i have it because when claire got rid of it i was like no claire don't get rid of it and um now i have it so super excited for that um the next polish from illa Masca is called nomad this is just a gorgeous green polish um i didn't realize there was a shimmer in it but it's very very small um i don't think that will be noticeable on the nail at all but look at that color of green so 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 pretty i think that's perfect for summer and um oh yes very very pretty looks like it has a nice formula too but we'll see the nail wheel can be very deceiving oh my gosh you guys look at that freaking green oh that's perfect for summer i am in love with that um i love these types of like minty greens i don't know if i have anything similar i didn't even really look through but man that looks gorgeous and then the last of the illa Mascas is called cameo and oh you guys this is the most gorgeous looking purple i have wanted this polish for years and years and years i tell you those nail board people when they decide to get rid of stuff it's like some of those de-stash sales, some of the de-stash polishes they put up, it's like, oh my goodness, is this really happening? Like, you're literally like, oh my gosh. And then you have to just kind of like go through the list and be like, oh, okay. But what's so funny is when I was going through the list, I was like, I want these for sure. And then let me get back to you. Because I didn't want to miss anything. Like, as soon as I saw Warm and Fuzzy, I messaged her. And then um, I like kind of kept going down. I was like, oh, I want this. Oh, I want this because I didn't want to miss, I didn't like want someone else to like grab my lemmings from me. Oh, to die for. Look at that, you guys. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to wear this. I like might wear this now, even though it's not even for fall. That is amazingly gorgeous. So those are all the polishes I got that were lemmings from the uh, Makeup Valley nail board Facebook sale site. And I got, like I say, I got amazing prices. Um, super, super excited. 
Then I want to send a shout out to Jessica from the Simply Polished Facebook page. She sent me powerful potion from Simple Colors. So I guess there was more. This was the last new polish from the Halloween collection. So instead of three new polishes um, that I put on my other video, I'll link that video down below in case you haven't seen it. But I did live swatches of the pol three polishes that for sure were new. This is the fourth polish that is new for the Halloween collection. People are finding these at my hair. I don't know. Um, I haven't seen it at my Walgreens. I haven't seen the Trend Matters at my Walgreens. So I don't know. She said there was a bunch at her store and she offered to go and get it and ship it to me. So thank you so much because this looks gorgeous. Look at that, you guys. It has a gorgeous shimmer. And then that color of like lime green is very, very interesting. So thankfully it is almost October because I can start wearing my Halloween polishes. So I usually wear Halloween polishes the whole month of October. It's like a big Halloween fest. Um, so I'm super excited for that. Halloween is close to my birthday, um, so I love Halloween polishes. I love Halloween nail art. And, oh, you guys, look at that. So that's two coats on the nail wheel. I'm sure it will need three coats on the actual nail because that is kind of sheer looking. But that shimmer, oh, my goodness. Ooh, that looks really, really pretty. Thanks again, Jessica. Um, super excited for this. So my next video I'm hoping to do will probably be um, showing you guys some of my favorite Halloween polishes. Um, I have like a ton of colors I like to wear, glitters, things like that. And I want to show them to you early. That way if you guys are like me and you start Halloween manis as soon as October starts, um, you have a little bit of time to go through your stash and see if you have any of these or hopefully I remind you of something you've forgotten. So that is it for this video. If you like this video, please make sure to click the like button down below. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please do. And I hope you all are having an amazing evening. I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.